Hello, it's Hacker007, and in today's video, I have a pretty simple, quick, and pretty awesome video for you guys. This will be accessing block websites, US Netflix, and just overall changing the location of your PC while on the internet. To do all of this, we can do it all with one simple Chrome extension called Hola, or Hala, whatever it's called. Anyway, what Hala allows you to do is simply access any website in the world. It unblocks websites and allows you to change your country so you can access a website as blocked to a certain country. So for example, some websites like Hulu.com, you have to be the US to access them. Me being in Canada, I can't access Hulu normally. Using this extension, when I access Hulu, it will automatically switch me to the US and basically allow me to access it. According to Hulu, I am now in the US. This also works great for websites like Netflix. You can change yourself to the US, go to Netflix, sign in, and it will think that you're visiting someone in the, in the US and will now give you the US Netflix experience. And of course, you can unblock websites from work, school, or wherever you are. Now to do all of this, it's pretty damn simple. All you have to do is go to the link below while in Google Chrome, and you have the option to click the free button here, which will install it. So click add, and give it about five seconds and it will install the extension to your Chrome. You'll know because this big thing right here will pop up. Now once you that once it pops up, you can click on the little smiley face guy here. You have some options to turn him on and off. So for instance, now he's off, now he's on. So you guys can just see what how it's going here. Now also, um hole right here says these are some popular websites that people in Canada like to access that are normally blocked. So you guys can see Spotify is not available in your country. But if I click it, it will unblock it for me and load it. And within a couple of seconds, Spotify is open. And of course, it's only blocked for me, but it's not anymore. Now you're also going to see in top right hand corner here, a uh, hole opened up and it's basically said um, you're on a US server. And you have the option to say yes or no if it's working correctly. If the server is not working correctly, it's loading slow or it just doesn't work, you can hit not working and what that will simply do is tell you, tell it not to use that one anymore, it will switch the server and hopefully you'll have better luck. But so far I've been using it for a couple days to be honest and I've not run into a server that does not work. So as you can see now I have Spotify and it works perfectly great. Uh, another website that's blocked in Canada is Hulu. So now you guys can see uh, Hulu's good to go. All right, so you guys can see it works perfectly great. Um, there's nothing wrong at all. It simply just works. So that's all I have to really say with this add-on, guys. It's not much to it. Um, basically, it will change your country if it needs to. Um, and besides that, that's pretty much it for this video, guys. So if you're interested in anything else, you can click on the Hulu add-on and you can change your country to a certain one, but obviously the most popular one is the United States. Um, they also have the UK available right there as well, so you can click that, and boom, now I have a, now I'm on Google UK, so you guys can see. And click it again, click US, and now, well, not, now I'm American. So there you go, guys. It's uh, pretty much as simple as that. And then, of course, you can click back to Canada. I live in Canada, so it says back to Canada. But whatever country you live in, it will be that. So now I can change it to .ca. And there you go. to go. Anyways, guys, though, uh, and then also you can click, sorry, before I go, click the options here and you go to my settings and you can choose some other stuff. Um, but besides that, though, it is pretty much good to go. Anyways, guys, thanks for watching this video. If you have any questions, comments, or concerns, leave them below. Otherwise, enjoy this add-on. It's pretty awesome. And I'll see you in my next future videos. This is the Hacker 0007, and I'm signing off.